Sometimes we want to put video inside of text. And in this fast tip, we're going to look at exactly how to do that inside of Vegas software. You can do this in any version of Vegas. It doesn't matter if it's 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, or 9. All right, so let's uh, dive in right now. Okay, what I've got here is I've already got a text track playing back. And we're going to add a little bit of motion to that text track by going into Generated Media going to the properties tab and dropping in a keyframe here at the very end and we're going to set that video up to track there we go now we've got a little bit of motion in our, our uh, text video happening there and next thing that we've got to do is we've got to go in and we've got to select what we're going to use as a background so we can click on a file here just to play it and see what it looks like no I don't like that one let's try this one Nah, that one's pretty good but not quite what I'm after um, I think I like this last one right here. So we're just going to drop this into a track down here and we're going to resize it and speed it up by holding down the control key and dragging off to the left here. Great. So now we've got our video playing, we've got our text playing, everything's going really well just like we want. So now all we need to do is put this video that we find on track 2 inside the text that we find on track 1. To do that we're going to click on the Make Compositing Child button here found on the video track next we're going to click on the compositing mode of the text track we're going to change that to multiply mask and that fast you can see here we've now got our video playing inside of our text looks great well there's some more that we can do with it we're going to grab the same video track and we're going to drop that down here and we'll shrink that up so that it matches and you'll notice our text more or less disappears at this point because our, our video and our text are, are really playing the same thing. So if we want that to stand out, all we need to do is drop a couple of effects on. Let's start out with a gradient map. and We'll drop a gradient map on here. And uh, how about we choose uh, the green light? That might be kind of cool. Or even blue light. Yeah, that helps a little bit. Let's try the blue light just to separate it even a little bit more. Great. All right, so the next thing that we're going to do is we're going to drop a Gaussian blur on that same track. So we'll grab the Gaussian blur choose OK and in here we'll set up for medium blur and just like that we've created a, a pretty cool effect so see it doesn't take very long at all and it's kind of fun to stick video inside of your text be sure to stay tuned for more fast tips from Vast